Here we go. Money talk. Here comes the money. Money, money, money. <laughs> hey, champs. Benny's in for finally, finally, another forgotten jams episode. And I have for you now Shane O'Mac. Shane McMahon. Yes, the big bad Shane McMahon. So let's go first with the poster here of Shane O'Mac, Shaney McMahon, and see his training abilities. So all the way at 9K, he has two abilities here. Yellow gems do 40% more damage, and moves that generates yellow gems will create one more yellow gem it's pretty good links so there's many links here mcmahon helmsley regime gems do 25 percent more damage the alliance receive 40 percent less damage from purple gems the corporation takes 60 percent less damage from yellow moves the ruthless aggression Matching any color gems, charge moves of that color by one more move point. Gears, only one set of gears. So let's take a look at the first build. So we have the Shane O Shuffle. Deals 48,165 damage. Reduces your superstar's yellow MP by 3. And heals 21,394 for four turns so basically to be able to use the shane o shuffle your coast to coast here your yellow move needs to be at least at three mp charge now let's move to the coast to coast deals thirty three thousand seventy nine damage and chooses six jams to destroy and the shooting star press deals 13,190 damage and gains seven yellow MP. Let's take a look at the entourage. So, of course, the blue MP trainer Jerry the King Lawler. This will put my shooting star press turn one. Then the coast to coast chooses 10 gems to destroy. Thanks to Zombie Shinsuke Nakamura. Yellow moves that destroy gems will destroy four more gems. Then coaches, I have the Big Bad Typhoon. Red gems do 15% more damage. And X-Pac, matching red gems. Charge moves of that color by one more move point. So the first match for Shane McMahon will be against Eddie Guerrero. Hall of Fame at 5 star bronze. So like I said, my shooting star press is ready. Let's hit it. Boom. Now my coast to coast. Choose, choose 10 gems to destroy. So let's try to refill our shooting star press. Nice animation there from the coast to coast. Okay, so let's use now the Shane O Shuffle here. So basically the coast to coast is at 4 MP charge, 4 out of 8. So this will like decrease by 3 MP with my Shane O Shuffle. But I will heal myself for 4 turns at 21,394. 
Boom! Cheney Mac, baby! So let's take away his green here. Oh yeah, of course, he's taking my blue! The shooting star press is ready. Boom! And now I'm a coast to coast. Let's choose 10 to destroy. I'm excited here. This Shano Mac is something else at 5 star bronze. This is really for all those free to play. Shane Omak is really something else. Again, my shooting star press ready. This will load my coast to coast again. And 10 more to destroy. And the board is reshuffling. I'm healing, I'm healing. 21,394. Let's do it again. My coast to coast is at 4 out of 8 MP charged. Let's go with the Shano shuffle here. So here, I'm not gonna go now with the Shano Shuffle, I'm gonna wait. Let's go the Shooting Star Press first. Coast to coast! From here comes the money! Shano Mac, baby! Little damage here, 140. And again, slowly healing. Again, 21,000. Here we go. So now I'm gonna use the coast to coast. First, the Shano Shuffle. Then the Shooting Star Press. So his finisher is ready. So we will get hit. Oh, he didn't use the finisher yet. What's the finisher here for Eddie? Oh, he didn't use it. Let's go with the coast to coast here.
We're gonna go again with the Shano Shuffle. And the Shooting Star Press. This will load my Coast to Coast again. And let's break another 10. Let's destroy 10 gems here. It's kind of slow. Pretty sure he's gonna use his finisher now. Here we go with those X Brick gems. Let's heal Shano Mac here. Shooting Star Press. Let's try to reload most of our moves. Again, shooting star press ready. Is it over for Eddie Guerrero Hall of Fame? Not any Eddie Guerrero. Not yet. Shano Shuffle here. So all three moves of Eddie Guerrero are ready next turn. But it's all over for the Hall of Famer. And look at this, Shano Mack, the winner. Wow, against a Hall of Famer. That's impressive. Yeah, it took around 10 minutes. So a pretty slow build. So let's take a look at a second build for Shane O'Mac. So we still have the shooting star press and the coast to coast. The new move this time, the running drop kick. It's a kick out and gains 52,477 in health. Entourage, no MP trainers. So slick Rick, woo! Any color gems do 20% more damage and Zombie Nakamura. Yellow moves that destroy gems will destroy four more gems. Coaches, I have John Cena, you can't see me, Masters of the Universe. Receives 20% less damage from red gems. And Zombie Charlotte, all damage increases by 27% for two turns after losing 30% or more. For Shane McMahon here going against a five-star bronze vader powerhouse that's a perfect 
perfect board for Shane O'Mac here. Let's go now with the shooting star press. Now the coast to coast. Let's destroy 10 gems. amount of damage 164k again the shooting star press ready it's the coast to coast Another shooting star press and another coast to coast. Finally, some green gems for Vader. It's Vader time. Let's kick out here with the running drop kick. Vader's finisher is ready. Nice amount of damage here, 152. One, two, and he kicks out. The Vader Bomb. Really, the coast to coast and the shooting star press, eh, almost every move ready. Vader! And it's a win for Shane O'Mac. So let's try another build here for Shane McMahon. So I still have my shooting star press and my coast to coast. And this time 
the low blow deals 36,976 damage and decreases the opponent's black gem damage by 94% for 4 turns. So pretty good against strikers. Entourage for this one, I'm using the same trainers, same coaches, so uh, Mr. Slick Rick here, any color gems do 20% more damage. Zombie Nakamura, yellow moves that destroy gems will destroy 4 more gems. John Cena, Master of the Universe, receives 20% less damage from red gems. And Zombie Charlotte, all damage increased by 27% for 2 turns after losing 30% or more. We're going here against Finn Balor, the Balor Club. Striker, 5 star bronze. see two black moves for Mr. Balor. So the shooting star press is ready. Let's go first for the low blow. And now the coast to coast. Oh, that's great. Look at this reduction on, on his black champs. 60, 66. Oh, now the bleed. Now we have the bleed on Shane McMahon. There's nothing we can do for the bleed. Let's go with the low blow here again. This will stack, I think. There's, there was two extra turns for the other one. Again, the shooting star press here. Oh, we're still bleeding here. Again with the low blow. Perfect because the shooting star press is ready and both my yellow moves will be ready again but this is stacking on the blue the black gems for Balor uh, it must be like a two or three five I don't know gem damage or something I can't wait to see the the gem damage of his black gems
Look, 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 the black, the black gems. He's not using his black gems here, here, here. Oh, come on, use your black gems. Use the black gems. Well, let's see now. More bleed. It's probably over for Finn right now. We took a beating this time. And that's it. It's all over for Finn. So another win for Shane O'Mac here. So that's it champs for this Forgotten Jam episode featuring Shane McMahon, Shane O'Mac. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please give a like. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do. Until next time. Pennies out.